welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello, my name is Beth. I am number three. I am obsessed with all things fashion. And this channel is all fashion, lifestyle, and family. And today's video, I am so excited to share with you. Coat season is here, and it is my favorite, favorite time of the year. This is my favorite time of the year for my wardrobe. And this video is a Topshop autumn or fall coat haul. I have gone a little bit crazy. I have bought a lot of coats from Topshop and I'm so excited to open these, have a little look at them all and share them with you. So if you love watching hauls like this from loads of high street stores, make sure you hit that subscribe so you don't miss any of my upcoming hauls. And if you do like this video, make sure you give it a little thumbs up. So let's get straight into the haul. Hopefully I should be sending some of these back. I might love them all, so I'm not sure. So please let me know in the description box which ones you think I should keep, which ones you think I should send back. And of course, I will be sharing with you all the sizing, the quality, what the fit is like, and all the details of prices and links and everything else will be in the description box. So if you see something you like, make sure you shop it. One thing I will say is a lot of Topshop good coats sell out fast. So I would think if you have something in your head that you want that for your winter coat, get it now because all the best stuff goes really quick. So let's get straight into the haul. <laughs> so I ordered, I basically just went onto the Topshop coat section and my thinking behind why I chose these coats were they were lots of different styles for different occasions. So, Hopefully there should be a coat in here for every occasion, so whether you need a coat for work, whether you need it for the school run, whether you need it for footballs, football on a Sunday morning, that is something for everyone. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I've been waiting to open this parcel. So basically I ordered five coats, hopefully I don't love them all and I can send some back, but we will see. So I'm just going to get stuck in straight away with the first one that comes to the top and it is this. So this is a black biker style faux fur um, biker jacket. I've never had one from Topshop before. I've had one before from Zara and I've worn it so much. I will probably wear it again this year um, but I thought I just wanted to try out the Topshop one because this one looks slightly shorter and it actually is. So it is this amazing faux fur black aviator style biker jacket. So this is slightly shorter than the Zara one that I have, which is good because it gives me a reason <laughs> to have it. So yeah, it, this, the, oh, the fur is really, really nice and soft. It's got silver hardware and then the belt which fastens at the bottom. One thing I did like about this is the belt doesn't go all the way around. So with my Zara one that I had, the belt was always like coming loose or going to one side, whereas this starts from each side so it won't fall off or you won't lose it. It has zips to the calf so you can wear them wider or do them right up and then has two little pockets now. This feels really, really nice actually. The fur is really nice on it, and the faux leather looks really, really good. From a distance, you definitely wouldn't know. No, you definitely wouldn't know that that's not real leather. Oh, it's nice. I feel like I'm gonna like everything in this haul. So yeah, the price on this one is 65 pound, which I didn't think was bad because this is the kind of coat that you'll definitely wear again and again. Uh, and I did get a size 10 in this because I just thought it's something that's going to look loads better, bigger, you're going to want to wear it layered with like things like this, like jumpers, hoodies. So I'd definitely wear this with like black knitwear like this, black leather pants, um, maybe some black skinny jeans and some boots. You could wear it in the evening, you could wear it really casual. I've had one of these style coats before and I've just worn it so, so many times. And yeah, this is fab. So let's have a little look what it looks like on and what the fit is like also. Okay, so I've put the jacket on. It feels really nice. Uh, it feels a really nice fit actually. So, so this knitted lounge where I have on isn't like massively thick, but with one of these coats, they're quite warm anyway. So you don't want to layer up too much because they do keep you really warm because of all the faux fur inside. Um, I really like it. I love the touch of the zips on the sleeves. My other one doesn't have that and I just think it gives that extra bit of detail and I love 
that these don't hang around too much and because of the part where it's fitted on the back you don't feel like you're gonna lose your belt halfway through the day so all in all I'm really happy with it the fit is really nice so I would recommend sizing up um, I got this in a size 10 whereas I'm normally a size 8 as I do think you want the extra kind of space underneath but the fit on it is so so nice and I definitely, definitely think I should be keeping this. So let me know in the description whether you think I should keep this one. And yeah, I'm happy with it. It is a nice, nice buy. You could definitely wear it with loads of other things, but like this all black outfit, I'm really feeling too. So this one was £69 and I got it in a size 10. Okay, so this next coat I'm also really excited about. It is a teddy coat and I have had, I think last year's version of this, which again, I absolutely loved. I wore all winter, it was like a cream faux fur teddy. And this year they have done an amazing, take this off. They have done an amazing camel, camel color. I feel like a camel coat is just something that you can wear again and again, all the way through winter. Oh my god, this is so so nice. So the one I had last year was longer. This is slightly shorter um, and it is slightly thinner as well, but that's probably quite good because the one I had last year was so thick you could only really wear it when it was really really cold. Whereas this I feel like you could wear even now as well. It's fully lined um all the way down. Is it lined on the sleeves? Yes. And oh it feels so so soft. It has this nice wide like double lapel collar and yeah the colour on that is so so nice it's like a nudie camel rather than like a really dark camel colour um, and that was going to look so so good I feel like this winter I'm just going to live in teddy coats and like coordinating colours so like a matching hoodie and like leggings and trainers and just really casual but again you could dress this up really smart for work as well you could wear it over dresses, you could wear it at night, you could wear it for bonfire night, you could wear it for Christmas markets. Oh, I'm so excited. Um, yeah, it's so, so nice. So this I got in a size small and I, size small and it was 69 pounds, which for a teddy coat of this quality and how nice this is, is an absolute bargain. So let us, let's try it on and see what it looks like on and how I'm gonna style it. Okay, so I've popped this jacket on. It feels really, really nice. It feels oversized, so even though I've got a size small, it definitely doesn't feel small on me. It feels like a really, really nice, roomy, oversized fit. So I would say, maybe not a size up on this one. Maybe just choose your regular size and it should be okay. Um, there's plenty of room under this for like a thicker jumper or a hoodie and it wouldn't feel it wouldn't feel too tight so it's really, really nice I love the pockets on it and I really like the length I think it's just a really nice length that just sits just below your bum and I just love it the collar is my favorite it's so big so when it's really really cold you can wrap yourself right up like this and put a scarf around and it just feels really really cozy yeah I would just say to order this in your normal size and you will be really really happy with it this one was £69 and for the price I do feel like the quality is really nice on it. I'll be able to wear it all winter and definitely get my money's worth and it just feels really, really nice and definitely worth the money. Okay, we're on to bag number two. <sighs> I don't even know what this is. Oh, I do remember what this is. Oh my God, I'm so excited for this. So I saw this and thought it was unreal I'm done so it is this unreal black faux leather trench coat or Mac I just fell in love with it I thought it's gonna look so so good like dressed up on a night out really glam or like really like all black outfits or dead casual with like a black hoodie black leggings trainers oh it's just unreal so it's like this faux patent leather and then it has exposed stitching uh on all like the whole of the coat on all the trims and then these amazing like marbly tortoise shell details on the buttons and also on the belt as well i just thought it was so amazing <sighs> so this would look so good for work amazing for like meetings or if you need to really really dress up 
also really really nice for nights out really really glam over a dress with heels but then again also just really casual so i'm thinking like black oversized hoodie black leggings a pair of like basic trainers like balenciagas or um maybe like alexander mcqueen's with the like the chunky sole would look really nice with these and then like a bobble hat or even just like a like a baseball cap or something would look so so cool i am in love with this oh my god it is 79 pounds which for me for the detail for the fabric for the fit you know it's fully lined i think it's quite a bargain because i think this is the kind of thing you would just wear so so much and i got a size 8 because i thought in something like this it's such a statement i don't want it too oversized um yes let's try it on i cannot wait to try this on and see what it looks like i feel like this is either gonna look amazing or go completely wrong <laughs> let's try it on and have a look okay so this is the like black patent mac now now that i've got it on i'm not too sure but i don't know if it's just the outfit that i've got it on with so i'm going to try it on in a second with like a bit more of a dressy look or just with like a black hoodie or something i'm not sure whether like the raw neck and then the jacket as well is a bit too like masculine for my style which means I don't I'm not really feeling it as much but the general jacket in general I absolutely love the fit on it it's like an eight this is a size eight so it's nice there's definitely not room for much underneath it so if you did want to layer more I would say to size up one because it does feel quite tight but I do think actually now I've got it on I would wear it more dressy than a casual with other things so let me change the outfit up and let's have another look okay so now i've got a different outfit on it's much dressier this is much more how i would wear this jacket like much more like a statement jacket on a night out like really glam and much much prefer it let's see how it looks over shoulders yeah so this is how i would wear it much more like a night out jacket i feel like if i wore this on the school run i would get much more crazy looks than i normally do already and yeah i love it it's a full like statement piece I think it would also look amazing like just an all black outfit but with heels like heel boots or something as well but yeah i absolutely love it it's definitely a statement piece and you definitely have to be quite brave to wear it but with the right pieces this jacket is gonna look unreal i love so i got it in a size yeah i got this in a size eight it was 79 pounds and I would say if you want to wear it just like how I do and not layer it, just go for your normal size. However, if you wanted to layer it more with like hoodies and things and wear it more casual, size up. So yeah, I'm in love. Okay, so the next pair I bought, I know what this is. So this is for me a like Sunday morning soccer mom coat. If you're from America, you're probably not going to understand this, but if you're from the UK, it is freezing. And when I have to stand on the sidelines and watch my boys play football on a Saturday and Sunday morning in minus degree temperature, I need warm shoes, big socks, and a huge warm coat. So this, I thought, this is just my, this is just going to be my Sunday morning football coat or my school run coat when it's freezing cold. It just looked like a big, huge duvet. And I love it, basically. So, on the runway, on the runways, um, right at the beginning of the year, when all the designers did loads of autumn winter coats, there was loads of this, which is basically just like an oversized, padded, duvet, coat kind of vibe. And I saw this, and I was like, yes, Topshop. Absolutely nailed it. So, it's just a huge oversized padded quilted like long oversized jacket and i just plan to wear this with hoodies and joggers and leggings and just be warm <laughs> or when it's snowing with like bobble hats and scarves and for all those times when i just need a casual coat but i still want to look like fashionable i still want to feel like my outfit is nice like this is the coat that I know that I'm going to reach for when I'm going on dog walks in the morning, when I'm taking Mary out in the evening, when I'm running around with the kids, when I'm on the school run, all those kind of occasions. I just thought this is going to keep me warm but still going to look amazing too. 
so it would look really nice with just all black outfit underneath definitely because of all the trims um, and the lining is black so that would look amazing also with like black leather pants hoodies <sighs> yes and again also like for things like bonfire night Christmas markets this is gonna keep me so so warm for all those times when I'm doing things with the kids oh I love it already when I'm doing things with the kids and I need to be warm but I also want to look nice too yeah this is gonna be the one it's kind of noisy but I think I think we're good and the price on this one is 79 pounds and I got it in a size small because I knew it was oversized so I wouldn't need to kind of size up or anything with that so yeah let's try it on and see how it looks on please don't drown me please look amazing please look how I think it's gonna look in my head <laughs> okay so this one is exactly what I wanted it to be it just feels like the biggest duvet ever I just feel so warm and cozy I've got my heating on so I'm literally dying because this jacket is so so warm um, but yeah it's exactly everything that I wanted it to be actually I just wanted it to be comfy casual really warm it's got a massive hood so even when I'm out in the rain on the school run or watching football this is gonna keep me dry it's gonna keep my hair okay <laughs> Um, and it just feels really really nice actually I've got my, this is my jumper underneath so the one thing I would say is the cuffs they could do with having like a little cuff there I prefer a cuff there but that's just personal preference but either way they look cute um, and yeah it just feels really really nice the fleece lining on the inside is super thick and warm and one thing I do like I'm just going to show you quickly is that you can do it right up I'm going to feel like I'm in a sleeping bag now <laughs> so you can do it right up like this but you can also it has a double zip so you can even you can just have it so this part is covered and then this bit is still got room to move so this is me for the winter on the school run feeling like I'm wearing a duvet and so so warm I love this I love the colour on it as well just so like neutral and will go with so so much so this is a huge thumbs up from me. I feel like it's the perfect winter coat for all us busy mums, the school run and all those activities where we need to be outside. And yeah, so the price on this was, one was £79 and I got a size small. So I didn't size up because obviously it's a big oversized jacket anyway. But I could have got away with another size, it just would have been super big and a bit more statement, a bit more of a statement jacket. So yeah, this again, I don't know if I'd send this one back or keep this one now, I want to keep them all. So let me know in the description whether you think I should keep this or send it back. Okay, we're on to the very last coat and I can't even remember what this is. I don't know what I ordered. Oh, I do, I do, I do. So this coat is one of those coats that I feel like every woman needs in her wardrobe for winter and it is your... I feel like this is the coat that everybody needs in their wardrobe for autumn winter it is just your essential camel, woolen, like a wool knit, um, structured, tailored coat. And I feel like every single woman needs this in their wardrobe. If you want to look smart, you can dress it up. If you want to team it with a hoodie, it's going to look amazing. It's going to look like full, like street style vibes. If you want to dress it up and you want a nice coat to put over your shoulders for a glam night out on date night or... or um, or New Year's Eve and you want a really nice coat to just throw on that's going to go with all your party dresses for the party season, this is going to be your coat. Like put it over your shoulders, it will just look really classy, really glam and I just, Topshop always do it, they always nail this perfect coat and they always sell out really really quick so I just grabbed one straight away. I got it in a size 10 because I kind of wanted it to be oversized, I want to be able to wear it with like hoodies and chunky knitwear underneath and it is just so so nice it's really soft it's double breasted and then it has these like tortoise shell buttons and it's fully lined uh, no so it's partially lined on the sides and it is just so soft and just feels such good quality and I love this this is just gonna be one of those, one of those things that I reach for the whole way through autumn winter for all those different occasions and yes 
everybody needs this coat. So let's try it on and see what it looks like, what the fit is like, and if I rate it as much as I think I do. So this is the camel coat. I got this in a size 10, and to be honest, I think I should have got a size 8 in this, so I think I'm gonna send it back. Um, it looks really, really good like this, like draped over my shoulders. I love the look of it. I feel like it just looks really expensive, really classy, and the quality on it is so, so nice. However, when I put it on, it does feel quite big. Um, and obviously I've got like a jumper underneath already. Oh, my hair out of the way. Um, but I kind of feel like it's a little bit too big here. Well, it is too big here. Um, and I wanted it to be a little bit more fitted. So I would say do not size up in this one. Just go for your normal size. I wish I'd sort of ordered a size eight in this. I think the eight would have been perfect with enough room to still lay things underneath. But apart from that, I love it. It looks so, so classy, it's so expensive. It's so versatile and neutral, so you can wear it with so many different things. And yeah, I just absolutely love this. The quality on it feels really, really nice. So yeah, this is definitely a win. This is 69 pounds, so a bargain for what looks like a much more expensive coat, but Go for your normal size, do not size up, do not make the mistake I made. Just order your normal size in it and it should be perfect. So that, that wraps up my Topshop autumn or fall winter coat haul. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I have. If you love all these coats as well, all the details for them are in the description box. So you can snap them up. A lot of Topshop styles go super, super quick. So don't wait around. And if you have any questions, of course, just pop them in the comments and I will answer all your questions for them. If you have any more questions on anything I didn't cover to do with sizing or fit or anything like that, then do let me know. I'm more than happy to answer them for you. And make sure you come and follow me on Instagram because I will be styling all of these coats up my own way and you can see more styling ideas for them if you choose to purchase these. So yeah, thank you for watching this haul. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you haven't already, hit subscribe. There's gonna be tons more fashion content coming your way over the next few months. And we're getting into autumn winter, so I'm gonna be sharing lots of like homeware things with you and lots of things I'm doing around my house to get our home feeling nice and cozy for autumn and Halloween and Christmas coming up and all the things I'm going to be doing with the kids so yeah make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out and hit that bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos so thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you all in my next video bye